Your Excellencies, ladies and gentlemen, the presence of so many heads of, heads of state or, or government here in Copenhagen is indeed a clear testament that the urgency of climate change, as well as the sincerity of purpose of the international community, has reached unprecedented heights. Sorry, there's a point of order. Sorry, Brazil, please. We have not received information on the report of the chair of the AWGLCA. We have not received news of the texts prepared within the AWGLCA negotiations, and yet references were made to new texts that would be presented um, under the authority of the presidency. So I would like to consult you on when the COP will open, when will we receive the report of the chair of the AWGLCA? What is the situation regarding these texts? And when will discussion begin based on the negotiated texts of the AWGLCA? Thank you. I think the world is expecting us to reach some kind of agreement concerning climate change and not just continuing discussing procedure, procedure, procedure. I'm fully aware that many have asked for the floor. But then on the other hand, uh, we have to move things forward. Okay, China for a final remark before we move forward. Thank, thank you, Mr. Chairman. I think the matter is not just a procedural, procedural, procedural. Actually, it's a very serious issue. It's a substance. It's uh, the respect of the host for the 190 at least 92 parties. This is part in dream process. You can't just uh, uh, put, put some text, put forward some text from, from the sky. Okay, um, ladies and gentlemen, I think we should uh, uh, continue. As I have uh, emphasized, uh, and as the executive secretary has emphasized, there's a meeting in the COP at, at one, uh, one o'clock. Uh, where it can be decided how to, uh, how to uh, uh, continue this uh, process. I want to uh, ensure the most distinguished speaker from China that it is absolutely not our uh, intent to put any text on the table from the sky. Um, first, we're not talking about one text, we're talking about two texts, fully respecting that this is negotiations in two tracks. Secondly, whatever we must decide uh, to put on the table in order to get things moving, because people around the world is actually expecting something from us. Chairman, sir, your observations did not address the question which was raised by G7 and China about the transparency and the text, sir. This text we had been working on since 7 a.m., till 7 a.m. in the morning today, and we were expecting the, we were waiting for the LCA chair to, to give us his observations and the progress that we had made on the text. Thank you. Uh, Bolivia have asked for the floor. Point of order. Mr. President, this isn't a process problem. It's a problem of content, the content of the text which has just been presented this morning. Since that content is not the outcome of a democratic process. Thank you so much. I, I just wonder uh, how you can make references to a text this morning. At this stage, we haven't presented a text from the, from the presidency. Uh, we haven't presented a text from the presidency. There is a meeting in the COP at one o'clock. We have indicated that it could be uh, productive based on the reports from the two working group to move things forward via a Danish proposal. But at this stage, we haven't presented a text. I think then we should move forward now. I really urge you to accept that we now start the list of speakers. Thank you, Thank you so much.